It's Friday. We've arrived in St. Augustine. Long four and a half, five hour drive, but we've made it. We're here in the hotel now. Um, practicing my tenor and bass uh, solos for tomorrow's competitions. I'm looking forward to that. The temperature and the weather looks amazing. I'm um, going to get some rest now and uh, catch a bite to eat, um, get a shower, hit the sack, and I'll see y'all tomorrow. Uh, Alright, it's six o'clock in the morning. Just woken up. Time to go get some coffee, a banana for breakfast, get changed into my uniform, and head to the games. Alright, I'm here at the Northeast Florida Highland Games. And the bagpipe is already making noise. Typical. Got my mask on. Walking around the competition uh, area. Piping and drumming competition. You'll see me drumming over here later on. Beautiful weather. Look at this. It looks great. <laughs> so the Highland Games has lots of animals here at the petting zoo. Here we have cows and horses. But back there we have uh, more cows, pigs, sheep. Lots of fun things for the kids to do. And, and really, there's a whole bunch of stuff here for the whole family. So, uh, yes, the Highland Games are great. Uh, great day out for everybody. So the Highland Games also has a lot of heavy athletics, including tossing the kyber, sheaf toss, uh, and a lot of other things. And that's held here at the main field. So there's a ton of things to watch throughout the day including border collie trials, uh, sheep herding, you know, just in incredible entertainment for everybody. And as always, the food vendors. Cameron's Scottish Food. Bridies, haggis, meat pies, all kinds of good stuff. Lovely, right here at the Highland Games. Lots of different foods for lots of different people. Another hot one. It's over 80 degrees right now, but I did pretty well. I got first place in bass drum and first place in tenor drum, so I'm very happy with that. Congratulations to everybody else that competed. I know they all did very well. I'm very proud of everybody that played. Um, opening ceremonies is in a few minutes, so I'll see you all there. All right, opening ceremonies. All the bands are lined up behind me, ready to play. It's going to be an amazing sound, wall of sound, especially inside this uh, great building right here. Look at this, beautiful. So uh, let's take a closer look.
And now here's my favourite part of the day. All the bands take turns and march into a circle for competition. The bands are graded 1 through 5, with 1 being the highest. Each band plays a set of tunes and they are judged and graded according to how well they play. They are judged on how well the pipes are tuned together, how well the pipers play together, how well the drummers play together, how well the entire band plays together as an ensemble. They are also judged on their tone, their musicality, and how well they attack at the set and how well they cut off at the end of the set. And usually during closing ceremonies, the winning bands from each grade are announced. I have to say what a great day it was today. Most people wore masks. Lots of hand sanitizer was distributed and used by the games. Thank you to the games for that. Um, everybody had a great time. And I hope that this will be the beginning of new seasons in competition going forward for the piping and drumming community as a whole. Another great day here at the Highland Games. Congratulations to everybody that competed. The closing ceremonies are going on now behind me. Um, I'm thankful for the Jacksonville Pipes and Drums for letting me hang out with them. Thank you. Um, and as always, I'll see you all next time.